All right, I'm talking to men's soccer player Austin Ferris, sophomore forward, has scored five goals this year, including two in the team's win on Wednesday against Marymount. Austin, uh, when did you first start playing soccer and what brought you to Point Loma? I started playing soccer when I was four years old, actually, in California, so it's been a long time coming, been 15 years. And uh, what brought me to Point Loma actually was uh, a coach I had. His sons, both uh, Derek and Brian Thames, played here. And he got me interested. I looked at it, and uh, with luck from Tim Hall, I was able to come out here. All right, and uh, why is the team, and you in particular, scoring at such a high rate this year? You already have five goals. I think really it's just the team unity. We're caring a lot more. We really want to win. We're doing everything we can to win. You can see the big difference from last year to this year, just just the team bonding, team character. And uh, you guys are 3-3, three and three, but you could be 6-0, and oh, a couple of... Uh, uh, heartbreaking losses. Uh, how do you guys get to the point where you win uh, your share of those close games like that? It's really we just got to clean up the mistakes. We've been having a few mistakes and uh, not really put uh, putting away all the goals that we can. And just those combined are just what how we're not getting the wins. If we clean up those, get some goals, then we should be good for the rest of the year. Okay, soccer is a strange game. One uh, good bounce can mean a win, a bad bounce can mean a loss. Is it frustrating to play sometimes? Uh, it's very frustrating, as you can tell, with the yells and the screams and just the, the tackles, the, just frustration. It's a tough game, but at the end of the end of the road, it's all worth it. Have you ever had a like a wide open goal and just missed it? Yeah, I've had I've had a couple of those, and it's it's heartbreaking. It really is heartbreaking. <laughs> Hey, what are your goals uh, personally and for the team this year? Uh, well, for the team, for the team, definitely make it to playoffs, and we're definitely shooting for nationals. We really want to make uh, a name for Point Loma. And uh, for myself personally, I want to get get some more goal, goals. You know, I would I would like to get double digits of goals this year. That'd be nice. Okay, conference play is over. You guys have the Masters come into uh, Point Loma on Saturday. They've struggled a little bit, but they uh, open the year at number two in the rankings. What are you looking for in this match? Um, looking for a hard work. They're they're going to be a tough team. I mean, second in the nation, they're they're going to be a good team. But it's on our field, and if we just play like we've been playing, play as a unit, score some goals, no mistakes, we should have a good game and come out on top. And what are you looking for in conference play this year? Conference play, I'm looking really for a lot of wins. Definitely place high up in the GSAC so we can get a good seed in the playoffs. All right, and a couple of. Uh kind of silly questions. What's the last movie you saw? Last movie I saw was actually Robin Hood. It was a good. It was it was different. It was it was different. I liked it though. Okay, if not playing soccer, what other sport would you play professionally? Professionally, I would really want to play football. Yeah, I played football in junior high. I was a kicker and it's easy, it's fun, it's brutal, but it's it's make good money. All right, and uh, besides soccer, what is your uh, favorite team on campus and why? Okay, right, let's think about this. I think my favorite team would have to be uh, women's volleyball. I mean, they're fun to watch. They're really fun to watch. They get pretty into the game. And uh, last thing, have you ever met anybody famous? I have not met anyone famous, but if I could, I'd meet Thierry Henry. He's my favorite soccer player, and I really hope to meet him uh, someday soon. All right, uh, good luck for the rest of the year. Thank you.